I'm Bob Rondo. Welcome to the Downtown Dogs with Jimmy Rogers. Are you kidding me? Welcome to the Downtown Dog Studio. I'm Jimmy Rogers. Approximately 37 years ago, the 1984 original Purple Rain football team went back to Ann Arbor and dominated a number three ranked Michigan Wolverine football team led by Jim Harbaugh. Our current Huskies are going to have a chance to repeat history September 11th. Fellas, if you can bring home a victory, I guarantee you a lifelong memory. Our first guest today is Jock Robinson. Jock, can you tell Husky Nation why you chose the University of Washington? Getting out of California, that was, you, that was my main thing. You wanted out. I, I, I got it. I, I can't, a lot of guys, I can't, a lot of guys I can't did. stay in Northern California. Yeah. You know, too many, too many friends and uh, no, that, too much that fun? wouldn't be good. That wouldn't be good. Too much fun? Yeah, but not, not just fun though. You know, Trouble? Least, yeah. You know, a lot yeah, of my guys found, were fun, gun, you had fun up here and all that. They were, I had that, you know. So with that in mind, who, who all offered you a full ride, a scholarship? I, I, I had a scholarship almost anywhere, Jimmy. So how many trips Notre did Dame you take? To, I, I, um, I took two trips. Only two? I took two trips. I went to Washington State. I was, I, that was the week before I came, to, came here. Okay. I never down to Washington. I was thinking maybe Arizona. I said no California. I wanted to stay in the Pac-12 because my mom could she can drive to um, sure. any, any game. She can, you know, Bay Area. She got to Cal Berkeley, Stanford, right there in the neighborhood. And then she can drive five hours to L.A., see her sisters and them. And she had family in Arizona. So we had family all the way up and down the coast. So I figured, yeah, I'll, I'll stay in, stay here. But you only took, usually back in that time period, to take My four mom, or five trips after, was like after exciting. After I came back from Washington, I told her I'm, I'm going to Washington. You were sold. I said, I'm going to Washington, Mom. So who was the so, player so, who so was had the player to hosted Hawaii. You? Yeah, I we had all a did. trip to uh, UCLA. <laughs> yeah. And my mom said, no. I said, I said, no, I, I get six trips, Mom. Yeah. She said, no, you already decided you're going there. So, so. you don't be showing a product and, 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 and these people thinking that they have a chance to get you and you yeah. already made your mind up. Right on. Right. So, okay, Mom. That's so pretty now, righteous. So that she shut that down. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty righteous. So you, <laughs> because back then, you know, I couldn't wait to take six trips. Exactly. And everybody had Hawaii. Exactly. And again, the coach finally said, the coach finally said, you know, are you really considering us? Right. No, I'm not. I, I just, I just never been to Hawaii. Yeah. I used to run and hide at school from Oregon. <laughs> My friends just come say, hey, scouts are here. I said, what school? He said, Oregon. I said, tell them I'm not here. Tell them I'm not here. <laughs> oh. So who was the player that was the host when you came to Seattle that weekend? Uh, Anthony and Aaron. Anthony and Aaron, okay. Anthony Allen and Can you and tell Aaron us about that weekend? And keep in mind, I'm trying to get some sponsors. Well, so uh, <laughs> you, don't, you, don't have to, you don't have to tell us everything. No, it was, no, I, it, it, it was great. Uh, Anthony uh, took me up to the, uh, to the central, to the CD, the central mm -hmm. color district. Uh -huh. I said, what's the CD? What does the CD stand for? You know, it's except for color district. I said, oh, for real? I said, no, it's... Central District, but yeah, we call it the Color District. I was okay. like, okay, and they had all the black restaurants, and we went to, to a real nice soul food restaurant and, and mm -hmm. ate good. And, um, and you know how cocky Anthony is. Yeah. So I can hear the cockiness, you know, talking about Washington and talking about this and said, we're going to the Rose Bowl. If you come here, you can go to the Rose Bowl with us. If you don't, we're going to kick your butt wherever you go. <laughs> if you go to the right? I'm uh -huh. like, okay, uh -huh. like the cockiness. Yeah. You know, so. <laughs> What was the basketball coach? The old, old guy? Uh, Harshman. Harshman. Mark yeah, Harshman. Yeah. He, he was the first one to come to recruit me. Yeah. Which was, brings up a really. He was the first one to come to recruit me I'm for basketball. Di I'm and dying. my coach said he's, he's that's his second sport. He's a football player. Yeah. And they showed him the, the football. Who said tapes. that? Well, um, they, they showed Harshman the football team. So the UW coaches coach were telling you. No, my 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 high school. Coach. Your high school coach was telling the UW it's not basketball. It's football. Said, yeah, he's a football player. He's. Football, basketball is a second sport. But what, so he showed he showed him the, some tapes of, of me playing football, and that's so, when Marv came back and and told well, that, coach. And then next you know, uh, Bob was. So that makes perfect sense because Jock, out of high school, you were a three-sport athlete. Uh, baseball, you were a catcher. Obviously, football. 
Uh, but basketball, what a lot of people don't know is you were in the top 100 basketball players in the nation. Number one was Patrick Ewing. I think Michael Jordan was number six, seven, or eight. Right nine, and you no were, number nine, and you were number 42. 42. So <laughs> when did you make that? Was it your coach that really pushed you to play football versus basketball? Because you could have played basketball anywhere. No, I, um, I knew I was a football player. You did? You know? okay. I mean, I, mean I, I, I love basketball. Believe me, I love basketball. Yeah. But, but I, you know. Well, football was easier, I, I felt like. You know, natural, more I'm natural. To, I'm at to continue to try to develop and, you know, continue to get better and do mm -hmm. better. And with football, you, you hand me the ball and I, I know what to do with it. Mm -hmm. So I, you know, so I'm like, yeah, yeah, coach, thanks, you know. Yeah. All the scholarship offers, because you know, that's what he promised me when I came to the school, you know. Was, mm -hmm. If you go to class and, 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 you know, do what you need to do. Yeah. <laughs> so I promise you I'll get you a scholarship to wherever you want to go. But USC was out. Just because it's California. Yes. Because mostly. I think we talked and years was ago. Southern California, you know. Right. And, and all my cousins down there, they're, you know, Too much fun. and Bloods and, okay. you know, and um, I'm like, no, I, I used to hate to go down there when I was a kid because, you know, my cousins, oh, you can't wear that. Mm -hmm. like, can't wear, you can't wear that red jacket. You can't wear them red shoes. Is that you know? right? So we were, you know, I'm, you tell an 11 year old that. I'm like, what? You know, mm -hmm. so it's kind of like, okay, I won't be coming. Mm -hmm. There's no schools down here. That's interesting. Yeah. So back to that statistic about you being in the top 100. I'm just, that, that's just fantastic. You know, it was Michael and Patrick, but those guys were one sport athletes. They did basketball 24-7, 365, <laughs> and you did all three. Yeah, I had a coach that, um, that kind of, he took personal interest in, 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 in my basketball. Okay. And that's what he had all the best basketball players in the nation. So you went? Nation. Or you just got invited? You went down to, you got, you had oh, you did? Invitation only. It was invitation oh, only. So in okay. California, I was one of the, one of the guys that you get invited to, to go and compete in that. And okay. It was a whole week of just basketball with seven footers and guys that, you know. Yeah. And all you did was eat, play basketball. Yeah. I actually met Ron Holmes. Didn't know who he was, but I, but I met him at the basketball camp. Is that right? Yeah, he was cutting in line at the uh, dinner table. <laughs> and every, and every day I see this guy just kind of dragging and, you know, and talking to people and getting in line. I'm like, dude, you know? So then I, and when I came to Washington, we're, we're, you know, we lined up to eat at the crew house, mm -hmm. and this guy is doing the same thing. Getting, and I said, hey, hey, I met you before. He said, well, I said, was you at the BC camp in Georgia? He said, yeah. I said, I, you was cutting in line then. <laughs> Get in the back of the line. <laughs> That's, that's, yes, oh, that's home, fantastic. Man. That's, oh, wow. <laughs> now, uh, a little bit more about Jock. I mean, we can talk about the stats, and we can talk about he is the one and only NCAA football player to ever and probably ever receive an Orange Bowl MVP and a Rose Bowl MVP, and the youngest player to ever receive a Rose Bowl MVP, <laughs> a UW Husky Hall of Fame, a Rose Bowl Hall of Fame, and soon-to-be... Orange Bowl Hall oh, of Fame. Oh, yeah, right. That's coming. <laughs> you calling that it's one? Yeah, I'm right. calling that. I'll get it done. <laughs> I know you will. Uh, a lot of people don't you know. You get on it, it'll get done. Yeah, you know I will. Um, uh, Jock's also a deacon. Yes. He's a, a father of uh, um, seven. He's got uh, four boys and three girls. Or yeah. a, a, So grand, a deacon, a father, a grandfather, a friend. And if you don't mind me sharing a quick story, um, mm -hmm. when my father died, back in 05, I think, in Portland. Yeah, I come from a, you know, it was a, I considered it a dysfunctional Irish Catholic family, and we had a melee before the funeral, and I was really hurt, and I went to the hotel, and I called Jock in Seattle, <laughs> and Jock kind of talked me down, and that was the end of it, and I went to sleep, but I told Jock I'm not going to my dad's funeral the next day. And, um, and then Jock, uh, I get a knock on the door of the hotel room, and there's Jock at 10 a.m., <laughs> Saturday morning, <laughs> Two martinis, and he says, come on, JR, get your suit on. And so Jock took me to my dad's funeral, made sure I got the suit on, went to the funeral, then he brought me home with him that day, drove me back up to Seattle. So that's the friendship that a lot of people don't know. I'm sure Mark does, yeah. but a lot of the people out there don't know that. So I wanted to share that. Um, Didn't you quote Howard Cosell or something about Joan, <laughs> Joan goes down? Or? <laughs> down goes Frazier. <laughs> So oh. yeah, so I'll never, never forget that. Yeah. Okay. I told Jim, I said, man, if, uh, I, you know, I know you can't get into it with your family, but 
Mm-hmm. So if you need me to put hands on your brother, I'll, yeah. I'll yeah. do that. Right? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I, I'm not a family member, right? You know, <laughs> you know I can smack <laughs> out of him, and, you know, <laughs> you know, and I'll just go home. <laughs> mm-hmm. So my my first recollection, I didn't pay any attention to the recruiting class coming in because I was fighting for a starting position, and I would have done anything. You know, I was trying to take O'Connor up on the right. field, off the field. I right. figured if we got rid of him, I could right. move up. And, <laughs> but uh, I remember seeing Jock uh, 2 a.m. We were sneaking back into the crew house, and he and Michael were coming in, holding the gate up. We'd always, you know, how you doing? You know, <laughs> always had a big smile, great personality. Uh, and then the next memory I have is you emulating Marcus Allen on the scout offense. Oh, yeah. Is that right? Yeah. And you were shredding the first team defense, and you had scout offensive linemen, <laughs> right? And the defense knew the play. And you were shredding them. And we're talking about some very good ball players, all Pac-10 well, linebackers. Well, we, you know, we was running USC offense. You know? Yeah. So that was just student body right or student body left. Uh, so it was kind of like run, run wherever you see daylight. Yeah. Kind of like, you know, so that's what. So natural. You know, and everybody didn't realize that to me, it, that was a game. That, that yeah. wasn't practice. Yeah, that was a game because I know. Yeah, I know uh, we have that's the best defense in the nation, mm-hmm. and I know how these guys hit. I, I'm watching them knock people down. I'm like, hold on, just practice. They hitting like that, so I'm Let's my go. chin strap is is buckled tight. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm out there running for my life, man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, mm-hmm. and I am I am running and cutting back and cutting back and and Coach Lambright was that was my savior. You know? Yeah, run it again. Yeah, he said, Jock, let somebody else run it. Oh, he did. Yeah. Oh, he took and care so, of you. So, so the second time he would let he somebody took else carry you. Yeah. And, and, so and, that was and, your freshman and they year. Were, and, and they would get the crap nailed out of them. Right. You know. And then, it, then the next time I come up, I would do it again. He said, "Run it again!" And drop. Let somebody else run it. Yeah. And, and those guys would get the the blunt. Right. <laughs> punishment. <laughs> They'll get the blunt punishment of it. So, so. You're, you're emulating Marcus Allen. Uh, you played in that that one of the favorite games in Husky history is the one where Freddie Small scored the touchdown on the kickoff. But I think that was the same game. It's one of my favorite runs of yours. It was third and one. Yeah, went from scout a, team to, to, to stop, the second back. To went the from scout team to, the, to, the number, second, two number two running back in the game. Yeah. <laughs> and it was third and one, and the linebacker was chip- and, set, and set on the sideline for the whole game into the fourth quarter. I think the last two drives, they thought, okay, now, now, now you can go in. Score? 6-3 like, hey. or tight game? It was 3-3. 3-3. 3-3. Three, three. Three, three. Three, three, yeah. Third and short, third and inches. Third and, third and two, I think it was. Third and two, they hand off to Jock and uh, Chip Banks. All right, everything. Yeah. USC linebacker has has Jock dead to rights in the backfield, and he does a 360 and dives forward for the first down. And the announcer was speechless. He just made a noise. <laughs> ah, I mean, we have it on tape. We're going to show it in a minute. That's one of my favorite runs. And it's only two yards. Okay. And right? all I re- all I remember saying is. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Pennsylvania thing. Better check Duffy out. Because yeah. I'm telling you, I mean, I was, I was barely getting the ball when Chip was, he was, yeah. he was on me. Yeah. Right. We was handing the ball. I'm like, whoa. Yeah. He was, he was, he was on me. And then, we, and then we kicked the ball off. <laughs> Took it, hit one of them. Went in the end zone. Yep. Twenty, twenty-two guys. And everybody <laughs> piled on. Everybody's in the end zone. They're pulling guys off the pass. And Freddie. Fred Smalls <laughs> jumps up with the ball, touchdown. Small. That was wild. Yeah, probably. And we, and we went crazy on the side. I remember the jackets, remember the big old, because it was raining so uh, hard. All you saw was the Husky big old jackets getting thrown all up in the Newspapers, air and, oh garbage God, bags. Was, they shut down 520 that it day. Was, it was crazy. We were coming over from the, from the right. east side, right. and they shut down 520. We had to go to I-90. Yeah. Right. Water was coming over the bridge. Over the bridge. Great That's memory. Right. As that four-lane highway swayed five feet back and forth. Here's the kickoff by Nelson. It'll be over the head of Crutcher. And Crutcher has to cover it in the end zone. Let's see what's going to happen here. Coming up with the ball is Fred Small for the Huskies. And it's going to be a touchdown. Terrible day. Yeah. Great day for yeah, Husky great. football. <laughs> great day for Husky football to have a Southern California team coming. So then we go to the Rose Bowl, and you were number two? And the, yes. yes that's number, behind? Behind Cookie. Behind Cookie still. Behind cookie. That's interesting. Okay, so you get, I don't know how many touches, 20 touches? 
140 yards? Yeah. We were standing around the whole first quarter just trying to get in the game. Yeah. So and you're not uh, and trying MC, to stay loose. M MC tells me, he said, go, go stand over by Coach Rob. Yeah. So I said, okay. So I, you know, I'll go stand over by Coach Rob. <laughs> and when I stand over by Coach Rob, Michael pushes me. Boom. And I hit Rob. I hit Coach. And he <laughs> turns around and I'm standing there, you know, I'm ready to go, Coach. So he looked at me like, yeah. So, and, and, and so Mike does it again. He pushes me to him again. And he finally says, okay, all right. Get in there. So uh -huh. I, right, right before the end of the first quarter. I... <laughs> so you go from MVP, 18 years old. Do you remember the moment after that game, or was there a moment that really stands out that you'll never forget? Whether as far as all the cameras and the I don't know I mean, if it's, it I don't worse. know if it's, oh my God, you, it was, you know, the podium with about 10 microphones on it and, you know, all, Mm -hmm. In this room with all these some number of reporters and everybody, I'm like, oh my god. 18, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm like, family? Okay, just asking questions. No, at that time, you just rushed me in there. Yeah, so you no know, family. Just, I, you know, whoa. But at the game, a lot of family. Oh, yeah. yeah. A lot of family. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, a lot of family. And we went everybody, back, to, went back everybody, to the hotel. Everybody was there. Yeah. 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 Do you remember after the, after the uh, game at the hotel or? No, and, I don't you know, either. I don't remember you know, that. Yeah, we yeah. probably shouldn't. So I, I, I remember, <laughs> but I, I I do remember. Remember getting our watches on Christmas. That remember was Christmas a big Day deal. when we got our. It yeah. was it was a big deal because. And then you go through. When your we family. get our watches, and we you know we go up and we and because Coach Lambright and Coach Pease and all those guys, you know, shaking everybody's hand, you know, getting the watches. Right. And Coach Lambright grabs me and say, shake my hand, and say, "Hey, get ready to play ball. You're gonna be the difference in this ball game." Yeah. Okay, Coach. Thanks. Wow. And Coach Pease tells me the same thing. I'm like, oh, okay, coach. So the defensive coaches liked you. And that's I said, I'm gonna be the difference in the ball game. That's what Lambo said. I'm like, get ready. I said, okay. Mm -hmm. And Coach P said the same thing. Get ready to play ball. You're gonna be the you're gonna wow. be the difference. I'm like, okay, all, all right. And this is five days, but on Christmas, so right. that's six days. And I was telling and I was telling my uh, my high school friends, you know, they said, you went to the Rose Bowl. I'm like, yeah. I said, hope I get in. And you know, try to try to. Uh, Maybe a kickoff return or anything. I was mm -hmm. thinking, like, you know, try to get a touchdown or something. Mm -hmm. and I, you know, that was just, and that was, and that was even, be, you know, before, that was before I even, you know, before watching it, before I got there. Mm -hmm. They're like, oh, yeah, watch him went to the Rose Bowl last year. He said, well, if you go to the Rose Bowl, I said, man, I mean, you know, maybe I get a kick return or something like that. You know, I can, 